Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel, RV Tips from Jan. Today's topic, listen up, we are in trouble. Fact, as few as 14% of RVers can find an open campsite on any given three-day holiday weekend. What you say? Let me repeat that. Do you know that as few as 14% of us can find open campsites on any given weekend. Let me explain. Here are some statistics from rbbusiness.com. We have over 11 million households here in the US who own RVs, 11 million. Much of the growth an explosion in RV ownership and interest happened during the pandemic over the last three years. Lots of people went out and bought RVs as a way to get out and get away when the hotels and restaurants were closed down. Number two, in today's world, there's only 1.6 million campsites that are available. 11 million RVs trying to get reservations at 1.6 million campsites? This could be big trouble. Is it any wonder that over holiday weekends, it's becoming more difficult to book our family vacation, particularly with multiple campsites next to one another? So how do we improve the odds of getting two or more campsites together for a long weekend or for a week-long vacation? Well, here's what our family does to get four campsites together for our annual summer week-long vacation. We follow this somewhat goofy plan that I will outline for you, but we find it to be an effective way to reserve our campsites. Tip number one in our plan. At the appointed hour on the first day that the sites become available at the campground that we hope to be able to stay at for our vacation, we have six computers online trying to make reservations for our desired campsites. That's right, six computers online. Typically within three minutes of the campsites becoming available after logging on, all open campsites are taken. If we're lucky, we may get two or three campsites reserved together. Tip number two in our plan. The next day, the very next day, we repeat this process. Again, with six computers logged on, trying to secure additional reservations for the sites that have opened up overnight. And I will share with you, we have done our homework to identify the areas of the campground where sites will be opening up starting the very first day that we want to check in. Tip number three in our plan. The third day, we repeat this process again, and usually by this time, we will get our fourth reservation for the fourth campsite. Again, we try to get these as close together as possible, and I will share with you that typically we can get two next to each other, maybe even three, and maybe a fourth one a little bit further down. It's interesting because as we've gone through this process over the years, we have had many other campers come up to us while we're on vacation camping saying, how in the world did you get your family members so close together? And we share with them that we have gone through this three-day process with multiple computers trying to get our desired campsites reserved. We only do this as a family once a year, and it's for our annual family vacation. We have 17 people, two dogs, consisting of my wife and myself, our grown children and their spouses, our nine grandkids, and our two grand dogs. This three-day process can be very stressful, but it is also very effective. We've done it year after year. 
Tip number four in our plan. We make this a family effort, coordinating with cell phones in each household and computers logged on. We're ready to pounce on the site reservations as soon as they become available. We actually use a countdown to the very second that we can make the reservations. We typically can get four sites together or very close together, but often we find that this typically will come down to the third day that we're online with all six computers trying to make that last reservation. Patience and persistence is the key to securing reservations at the campsites we want in the campground we most desire for our family vacation. This is a family effort and we only do it once a year for our annual family outing. We try to make it as much fun as possible without stressing out too badly. This works within the established reservation system while making the most out of the computer technology, including coordinating with our cell phones that we have available. It does work. This is how we've reserved our family vacations every single summer. Thanks for watching. And we wish you the best of luck in reserving your most sought after campsites, particularly if there are multiple campsites together for this summer. And as we say at the end of all of our videos, please continue to be safe and stay well.